Hey, good morning, YouTube. You're probably wondering what kind of fool would do a snowplow video on June 1st. Well, I guess I'm that fool. I had the blade out this morning, grading the driveway. We've got a quarter mile long, real steep gravel driveway. It gets washed out real bad. And the blade does a pretty decent job of smoothing it out. But this video is my storage solution for off season. Most people, I think, just sit them on the ground. Um, I know. This is a used blade I bought. It's rusted out there, rusted out there, rusted out along there, which seems to be kind of common. This is the second blade I bought. The first one was even a worse shape than this one. Uh, rusted in the exact same spots. So I think the way, the way you store them and the water lays up there and it just, it just rusts them out along those seams on the back. So I was watching another video. I believe it was produced by... Uh, boss and they had a a kit similar to what I've made here for off-season storage I've just taken a piece of one inch pipe welded a plate to the bottom of it put a caster on it made two of those and bolted a caster to the bottom of the stand so all you have to do for off-season storage might be fun with one hand holding the camera. Stick that in where the foot goes. Put the spacer on it. Put a linchpin in it. Because I don't know about you, but I believe everybody I know that has a blade does not run the shoes on these. Even with the gravel driveway, I don't run the shoes because you just you just can't get a clean enough cut. And if you do, it just takes a second to pull the shoes out anyway. Okay, that supports the blade. down first. Yeah, they always work better with the key on. Okay, we set it on the ground. Install your foot like normal. Break it down, take the weight off. Now, I don't think this uh, caster would work if I was on level ground, but I just nose the truck in the garage so it's kind of pointing uphill so it's a little higher. But uh, it works for, works for the situation I have. Two front blue pins. And hook the electrical connection. And simply pull the blade right away from the truck. Doesn't turn the greatest because it's on three casters, but there you go. That's simple, other than getting it off the truck, of course. I can roll that around the garage all I need to, get it out of the way, and it goes back on quick. Pull the truck in, roll it into the truck, pin it up, and you're ready to go. Hope, uh, hope that storage solution helps somebody. Have a good day.